through tonight, people armed with baseball bats bashing the glass doors of a homeless shelter. The group running the place says this isn't even the worst of it. They say the harassment has forced families to find somewhere else to stay and put some back out on the street. This violent attack last week on St. Anne's Place in North Minneapolis led to 16 families being moved out of the shelter. The normal response is to be afraid that their intention was to cause fear. Wong Murphy, who runs the shelter, says he knows exactly who did it. The neighbors across the street. He says smashing the glass panel doors with a bat was an escalation of a parking disagreement involving a resident's van. But that wasn't all. They heard two gunshots, and then uh, there was also two bullet holes in the van when it w when we went outside to uh, you know address it. Uh, and that's also you know a guest reported being pistol whipped, uh, hit um, in the front of her head and in in the back. Police were called, but the shelter is baffled and frustrated that no one's been arrested. Charges need to be filed because uh, that's the beginning of then you know making sure that this is safe and it's a trusting place that then families and staff can return to. MPD told WCCO, officers were not able to establish a level of certainty that supported an arrest. All involved individuals were identified and the case was assigned to an investigator. A spokesperson says they are reviewing all footage. In the meantime, MPD put a camera up front and says they are doing extra patrols in the neighborhood. The shelter has also hired 24-hour security. I would like to hope that we all have the same goal here, which is that we want to make sure that justice is served. You know, we've identified these folks. They have identified these folks. This needs to be addressed. The shelter was home to 54 women and children. They have lost track of two of the families. The rest are in a hotel, which the shelter says is not a long-term solution. The search for a solution to our homelessness crisis was a heated topic today at City Hall. The Minneapolis City Council heard from dozens of people over a two hour long hearing for new rules about homeless encampments. Those rules would require more reporting about how camps are cleared and the resources given to the people forced to leave. Today, a woman who lives at an encampment told us that the current system is not helping. Basically, they're just kicking us out and where are we going to go next? Out here, it's hard. It's scary, you know, sometimes we just need a, a direction of where to go, you know, other than just got to pack up and got to go. Council member Andrea Jenkins is also forming a think tank to discuss immediate and long-term actions, and those meetings begin next week.